Please pause for a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. New movies out this week in our sports show. And we're working out the Wildcats, coming up next on NHS TV. Tonight, your Texans are playing Denton Guy are here. Come work out the Wildcats. Don't forget to buy your pink out t-shirt and bracelets during lunch today and at the game tonight. Proceeds will be donated to the Susan G. Cohen Foundation to raise awareness for breast cancer. Now over to the sports desk, here's Sharice Lee and Tyler Berenger. Good morning, Texans, and welcome to NHS TV Sports. I'm Sharice Lee. And I'm Tyler Berenger. The Max Preps Player of the Week and our quarterback, Dre's Lawless. Dre's broke a school record two weeks ago by throwing for 424 yards and three touchdowns. Dent Geyer is currently 2-1 for the season with their only loss against Cedar Hill at Cowboy Stadium. Our Lady Texan Volleyball team play at home tonight against Denton Geyer. Make sure you come out and support them tonight at 630. The Dallas Cowboys take on the Washington Redskins in their home opener on Monday Night Football. Quarterback Tony Romo suffered a fractured rib and punctured his lungs in the dramatic overtime win against the San Francisco 49ers last Sunday. Even though Romo was in pain and had difficulty talking after Sunday's game, he said the fact he was able to finish the overtime game meant he would be able to play against the Redskins. He is expected to be the starting quarterback in that game. In hockey news, future Hall of Famer Mike Madonna has officially retired after 21 seasons. Madonna played 20 seasons with Minnesota and Dallas Stars before finishing up his career last year with Detroit Red Wings. He helped the Dallas Stars win their Stanley Cup and will always be remembered by Dallas Stars fans. In college football, Nevada takes on Texas Tech. Oklahoma State travels to College Station to take on Texas A&M. Missouri is at Oklahoma. Indiana visits UNT and Rice plays Baylor. Texas has a bye week. Remember to pick up your pink out shirt during all lunches and wear them to the football game tonight and the volleyball game on Tuesday. That's it for your NHS TV Sports Report. See you next week. Now Courtney Key with your chance to win free Harkins Zumbi tickets. Good morning, Texans. Welcome to this week's Harkins Movie Preview. I'm Courtney Key, and today we're going to take a look at three movies in this week's trivia question brought to you by Harkins and Southlake. Abduction is a thriller centered on a young man who sets out to uncover the truth about his life after finding his baby picture on a missing persons website. Shakuna, run! So there's a leak. Whoever these people are, I have to stop them. I want confirmation! They're here already. Listen to me, Nathan. We're going to find you. Not if I find you first. Dolphin's Hill is a story centered on the friendship between a boy and a dolphin whose tail was lost in a crab trap. A symbol of hope breaks through. It's okay. Trying to put a tail on a fish. Nobody in his right mind would even try. Luckily, I'm not. Not what? In my right mind, they saw a reason to risk it all.
Moneyball is the story of the Oakland A's general manager Billy Bean successfully attempting to put together a baseball club on a budget by employing computer-generated analysis to draft his players. This team will have changed the game. This week's trivia question, Brad Pitt works for which Major League Baseball franchise in Moneyball? Be one of the first two to text in your answer to 37607. Include in your text 183509, your teacher's name, your name, and the answer. That's it for this week's Texans. Remember, bring your student ID to Harkins Theaters in Southlake and get a student discount. Have a great day. That's it for today's show. Have a wonderful weekend.